Hey guys, so as y'all know, I am on a hair straightening journey and it's been a lot of fun. I permed my hair and I've been keeping it straight for, I think I permed it sometime in February, early February, January or I don't know, but it's been a while now for me because I never wear my hair out. I usually put it on like protective hairstyle, add some fake hair to it or whatever, but this is all my natural hair, natural locks. And I'm, I'm really having a lot of fun with it. But this video is about what I use to straighten this. <laughs> okay, I think I'm going to get a kick out of this. This is... Alright, I'm like... Okay. This is a men... Is this for men? Is a men hair straightening beard brush. <laughs> okay, I didn't even know men had this out. This... Is meant to straighten your beard like if you have a beard you know how men got some really good beards going this is a, a hot comb it's not a comb it is a hot comb that straightens your beard and I pretty much really like it <laughs> but let me show it to y'all okay so I have heard of girls using this but I I was nervous. I was like, oh my gosh, it's not for like the head hair. It's for your beard. But I figured if it's for your beard, it's like on your face. So wouldn't it be like even better for your hair? This is what it looks like. Okay. It comes with um, a little bit of instructions. Got the instructions in there. And when I took it out, I said I, my hair is already heated. I would love to have done a heating video with y'all, but I don't want to overheat the hair. When it comes to like uh, African American hair, you don't want to keep overheating it or it will break off. So I've already heated it. I don't want to do it again, but I did want to show y'all like this is not the result from this certain one. Um, I did a couple of methods and I'll tell y'all why. Okay, so this guy, this is what it looks like. Now it's really easy to use. The only thing you have to do is turn it on and it has one saying no you can't really adjust the heat so the heat goes up to how much the heat goes up to I actually don't know um it just goes up to whatever it's got a nice little cord it's not a super long cord but it's not it's not bad and it heats up and you turn it like keep it on heats up fairly fast and you take it and you take that heat and you comb your hair with it and when it's hot you just like this and it's made for beards. It's supposed to be like this on people's beards. And I was cracking up off of that. Now, here's my pros and my cons. All right. So, pro. It's easy. Like, did you notice my camera just changed? Like, it got so dark. Then the sun just changed. Okay. So, pros. It's easy. It even has a little swivel. So, like, it won't get tangled when you're doing it. You just put, your, put it in your hair and it just combs it. It was so easy. I was able to get into like the kind of like the thick part because my hair is always trying to re uh, tighten up. I have very tight hair, like the tightest freaking hair. I've now permed it and it's still tight, but you can get into the roots and I was able to get into it. Now the cons, if I get burnt my hair somewhat, like it, like you can't, it's so easy that you want to keep using it. But you can burn your hair. And I didn't like the smell after I was done using it. It was fast, it was easy, but it made my hair smell like it burnt it. And I was like, uh-oh. Now, I didn't see any bad results. I didn't see no bad uh, results. It felt fine, but the smell was kind of weird. I don't really know why. I might have on it just a little too long because you can do that. Or when, because it's a comb, the hair might got caught up inside of it and start burning on its own. Because it gave me like a, a, a hot head, heated smell. I didn't care for that. But, and another thing, another con, is that it didn't make it as silky smooth. So this is not the results of this because I needed to take my presser and silk it down. Like, kind of like silk it down. But this one was a lot of fun because I was able to just get in. And I didn't have to do anything hard. I didn't have to space my hair around. It was just grabbing just like that. Now, I don't know the lasting effects is going to be. But I thought it was funny to use a beard hot comb. And yes, girls can use it for their hair. I think that if you have a looser grade of hair, I think it would work out better. Because if you just need that quick uh, press and you don't mind your hair kind of being like fluffy. Like I wanted it to be silky. So my hair is a little fluffy right now. But when I first did it with this guy, it was kind of like on like the poofy side. Like it kind of like blew it out with that heat. And I was like, oh, it's not silky. Because <laughs> a beard is supposed to get blown out. So even, even if you watch a guy, like I watched a guy use it for his beard. 
and when you watch the guys use it for their beard it blows it out it makes it like kind of like poofy and i didn't want my hair poofy i wanted it slick and straight so if you want slick hair no but if you want quick fast hair that you just want to make it hot and tamed and your hair can handle that your hair's already kind of glossy and doesn't need to be slicked then this is not terrible so tell me in the comments guys what do y'all think is it crazy that i used a beard hot comber for my hair <laughs> but i did i saw the reviews and other people did it too so i like it i think it's kind of neat it's kind of more so novelty like i don't really think i'll be using it again because i like the slick look but it is a lot of fun to look at and i think if i ever want to go natural again this would be probably kind of good to just give my hair a quick you know heating without like having to straighten it like the hard way so i like it so tell me in the comments what y'all think and tell me if y'all have used something like this before even if it's on your beard okay guys bye <laughs>